थर्ड प्रॉब्लम स्ट्राइट लाइन थ्रो क्यू ओ थ्री का टू मेक्स एन एंगल पाई बाय सिक्स विथ द पॉजिटिव पॉजिटिव डायरेक्शन ऑफ द x axis if the straight line if the straight line root 3x minus 4y प्लस एट इज इक्वल जीरो एट पी फाइंड द डिस्टेंस पी क्यू डिस्टेंस पी क्यू लेट मी रिपीट द क्वेश्चन स्ट्राइट लाइन पासिंग थ्रो क्यू थ्री रूट थ्री का मार्ट टू मेक्स एन एंगल फाइव बाई सिक्स विद द पॉजिटिव डायरेक्शन ऑफ द एक्स एक्सिस वेट वेट दिस प्रॉब्लम वन मिनट स्ट्राइट लाइन इंटरसेप्ट सॉरी स्ट्राइट लाइन थ्रो क्यू रूट थ्री का मार्ट टू मेक्स एन एंगल पाई बाई सिक्स विथ द पॉजिटिव डायरेक्शन ऑफ द एक्स एक्सिस इफ दट सेम स्ट्राइट लाइन इंटरसेक्स दिस लाइन एट पी देन डिस्टेंस बिटवीन पी पॉइंट एंड क्यू पॉइंट वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट सो दैट मीन्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू टेक लाइक दिस दिस कॉर्डिनेट एक्सेस आर इजिन x axis and y axis suppose line is making like this angle so line so what is the angle pi by 6 with x axis positive direction okay there is a point p said sorry q point root 3 comma 2 it cuts the line another line that line is c root 3x minus 4y plus 8 is equal to 0 at p so this distance we have to find out let us think how to solve this problem okay i hope you might have got an idea see the point p on this line we can find out see making theta is equal to pi by 6 with x axis positive direction or anti clockwise direction and point is x1 comma y1 is root 3 comma 2 this we do not know say r now parametric equations of this line we can find out at the point p we can find out in terms of parametric equations that is x1 plus r cos theta y1 plus r sin theta this p point lies on this one so by substituting r value we will get it r value is nothing but distance between p point and q point that's all so that means first of all here slope of this line we have to find out here solution write down given theta is equal to pi by 6 30 degrees so that is positive direction anti clockwise direction so you can find out now 
you need not find out the slope also. Let us say let p q is equal to r, this is to be determined parametric equations right of or the coordinates of p, the coordinates of p is equal to x 1 plus r cos theta y 1 plus r sin theta. Okay? We do not know the r value. Here x 1 x 1 comma y 1 means from root 3 comma 2. Let us substitute respective values root 3 plus r is not known cos 30 2 plus r into sin 30. So, now we should know sin 30 and cos 30 values. What is sin 30? 1 by 2. What is cos 30? root 3 by 2. So, now this we can write root 3 plus root 3 by 2 in root 3 r by 2 comma 2 plus r by 2. According to the problem where does p lie? p lies on this line. So, that means p lies on root 3 x minus 4 y plus 8 is equal to 0. Now, the coordinate should be replaced. So, this we can write like this root 3 times root 3 plus root 3 r by 2 minus 4 times 2 plus r by 2 plus 8 is equal to 0. Carefully we have to simplify root 3 into root 3 3 plus 3 r by 2 minus 8 minus 2 r plus 8 is equal to 0. Okay? Minus 8 plus 8 gets cancelled. Here 3 r by 2 minus 2 r. 3 minus 3 r minus 4 r minus r by 2 is equal to 0. So, we can write r by 2 is equal to 3. What is r? So, r is equal to 6. But actually what is r? nothing but distance between p and q point. Therefore, p q is equal to 6 units is answer 6 units.